I'm going to be looking at the Yukos 62 inch tripod stand. Keep watching the video. Welcome back, it's Jeff Lepard from JeffLepard.com and on this channel we do product reviews, do-it-yourself videos, vacation videos, and so much more. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. Today we're looking at the Yukos 62-inch tripod stand. There's two different versions of these. One is white and one is black. They're both identical. What I'm going to be doing now, I'm just going to unbox one of them and let's see what we got inside. I'm going to leave a link down below in the video description if you want to get one of these. Okay, so we'll just move the box out of the way. So right away we have the user manual, the instructions in the top. We have the unit itself and we're going to be looking at it in a second. Here's the Bluetooth remote. And that's gonna control taking pictures or video. This is your phone holder, which is uh, adjustable to uh, all different phone sizes. And that uh, is gonna be attached to the tripod stand. And here we have an action uh, adapter. This is great for a GoPro. Uh, keep in mind, if you have the brand new GoPro, you uh, don't necessarily need this adapter since there's already uh, a screw on the bottom of the new GoPros. And of course we have a uh, carrying case to keep your stand nice and uh, free from damage. So right now I'm gonna show you how to set up using your phone and a little bit about this tripod stand. You can see we have a remote control holder, uh, which is excellent. This is the stand part. So to open that up, we're just gonna uh, just make sure this is loose. You have an adjustable uh, knob there and once you get that, you can just tighten that. That'll secure the uh, tripod stand in place. And we'll put that on the table right now. Various uh, adjustable screws here. This, of course, is gonna adjust to the adapter piece once you get that on, whether you're using the action cam or you're using your phone. And of course, we have another adapter which you can get the tilt uh, to the angle, desired angle. This also extends up, and uh, that's a, an excellent, excellent feature. It uh, goes all the way up, of course, 62 inches, and we'll later on show you that uh, later on in the video. Next, I'm going to show you how to attach the phone. So if you're like me and you have a very large phone, uh, just be rest assured that this also holds a very large phone, which is really great. So first thing we got to do is just loosen off and uh, open up the grip and uh, we'll see about putting this in. What's also great too is I still have the phone case on and given that a tight, uh, tighten up, look at that. So I'm, this is currently the Samsung Galaxy S22 and uh, it's holding that quite nicely. So I'm gonna put this down, sit it right on top of the screw and of course there's an adjuster, uh, adjustable knob and that's going to tighten the holder to the tripod stand. And once you have that, you can then adjust however you want it. There's an adjustable screw on the back, which will tighten it in position, whatever way you want it. Uh, this also does uh, vertical and horizontal. And there you have it. I'll show you how to use this vertically as well. All you're gonna do is just loosen this off and you can feel it, a uh, small little click and uh, just put your phone into the desired position again. Tighten that up and make sure this is locked in place. If you have to do any adjustments, you do that with this. And just like that, you're now ready to film vertical. Now I'm gonna show you how to use the remote control that comes with the tripod stand. So I'm just gonna be using my uh, Samsung Galaxy here. So first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the uh, setup screen there and click Bluetooth. And you're gonna see a list of available devices. There's a button on the side. I'm just gonna switch that on. You'll see a flashing blue light. 
And then you'll see here available de devices, AB Shutter 3. I'm gonna go ahead and hit that. Bluetooth pairing request, I'm gonna click pair. And we are now paired. We're gonna open the camera app. And here we have just a, a picture. So anytime you wanna take a photo, I'm just gonna go ahead and hit the button. And there you go, you have the picture already set up there. So same thing for video, I'm just gonna use the video here. It'll start and stop every time you wanna record or pause to stop the video. Simple as that. Now I'm gonna show you how to install an action cam like the GoPro Hero 11 here. So for this, I need the adapter. If you have a GoPro Hero 12, you're not gonna need this piece because there's gonna be already a place that you can put the screw in. But this, I need the adapter. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna screw this on. So I'm just gonna go ahead and screw this piece on. Just like that and snug that down nice and tight. Take the screw out. And nice and easy. And there we go, just like that. You can tighten it and you can loosen it just to move it up and down. And there we have it. I'm gonna leave a link down below in the video description if you wanna get one of these. Now I'm using the white Yukos tripod stand. So as you can see, I have it extended out to take a selfie. And of course I'm using the remote. It would be next to impossible to hit the button on the phone. So this is awesome because uh, you can put it in video or picture mode and just snap a picture just like that. When you're not using the tripod stand for a selfie stick, you can also extend the arm and use it as a stand. If you're filming out and about, you can film yourself, film everything else around you, and you don't have to hang on to it. So that's a look at the white and black Yukos 62 inch tripod stand. I just want to thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, bash that bell to turn notifications on for all upcoming videos. Share the video, like the video, leave a comment down below. And we'll see you in the next time on the next video. Jeffelpard.com. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.